Alright everybody, now today in this video, this is going to be a very, very short one, but I decided to turn on the face cam for this one and just talk about this one comment I got, um, and it, it, this is going to be hilarious, okay, so, um, yeah, let's just get right onto it. So, for those of you who don't know, a couple days ago I posted a video called the SML Inconsistency Problem, where I just basically talked about how SML's been super inconsistent, um, and how they've made like the best video of, of the year followed by the worst video of the year like literally one after another or they'd make like two out of ten videos followed by a nine out of ten video right after like it just doesn't make sense and the inconsistency is kind of throwing off the entire um, flow of the SML channel lately and it's been a really big problem in 2023 but anyway video aside I have to talk about this comment here so um, yeah basically <laughs> I don't even know what to say about this, but um, let's read this comment together because I have not laughed at a comment in like for two days straight l l like this one. I don't know why. It's just this comment was just priceless to me. Um, so if you guys want to send more dumb comments like this, you definitely can. Um, just do not like just do not make it so believable that I'm like going to get in trouble for it. But Anyway, so Ray the Beast says, I visited Florida a few weeks back and I actually ran into Super Mario Nick at Panera Bread. I asked for his autograph and he promptly put me in a headlock and brutally delivered blow after blow <laughs> perfectly to the center of my face. This continued for a total of 1 minute and 57 seconds, after which he released me while I was rushed to the hospital. I just got out and have fully recovered from the physical and mental trauma. Keep up the great work, Super Mario Nick. Oh my god. Um, so I wanted to talk about this to give you guys some context, um, on why this comment really stood out to me because I've been to Florida many times for those of you who don't know, I am Canadian. And so I've been to Florida a few times. Um, and you know, when I have, I've been to Panera Bread before. Now, now when I first read the first sentence of this comment, I was like, Hmm, did I ever meet a fan of Panera Bread? I was, I was like trying to think and I'm like, I don't think I have, right? I'm like, there's no way I have, right? Um, and so, yeah, I was thinking about it. I, I realized, okay, I did not meet a fan of Panera Bread. Um, and I'm like, okay, this guy's probably just bullshitting, but let's just read the rest of it, right? And then it says, I asked for his autograph and he promptly put me in a headlock. Now this, to me, was just absurd and it had me dying, right? Because I was like, okay, I would never do that to someone. Um, but I know people will believe this because I've said on my channel that I've been to Florida before. I um, mean, I've been a few times, actually. Um, but just to clear the air up, this is not real. And yes, I, I have been to Florida, but it was only, I would say a year, a year and three months ago. It was, um, 2021 to 22 new year. Right. So like about a year and three months ago, I went to Florida. Right. Um, and so I saw, um, I saw the area things like that, but you know, it obviously I, it was not a few weeks ago. Right. So it obviously, you know, that's that, but I feel like people like actually believe this though, because I've said, I've been to Florida many times on this channel. Um, and then, yeah, this continued for a total of one minute and 57 seconds. I love the precision there. I love how he just kept, you know, kept track by the second of how long he's been in that headlock <laughs> after which he released me and I was rushed to the hospital. I just got out and I've fully recovered from the physical and mental trauma. And then he follows this by keep up the great work, Super Mario Nick. I, I, I don't understand what to say to that. It, it, it's the ending for me that was hilarious because it's like, you, you just said you've been through like weeks of physical and mental trauma. And then you follow it by keep up the great work. Like, how am I supposed to respond to that? Um, just, to, just to confirm and debunk the rumors, this is not real. Um, to anybody who thinks this is real, this did not happen. Um, but it was a super, super funny comment and it was top liked, um, 27 likes, 27 replies. Like it, it's, it's just, it, it was, <laughs> some people didn't believe it. So I, I just had to, you know, clear the air, but even for those of you who haven't seen this comment, I think this was just super, super funny to go back and, you know, just check out. And if you guys do have comments like these, you know, that obviously are not as like, I mean, you can make them descriptive, don't get me wrong, but just don't make it so believable that I get in trouble for something I didn't do, right? But this is hilarious. I mean, absolutely hilarious. Um, and I would love to make more videos like these, talk about these comments, um, if you guys do enjoy them. So yeah, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. This is a very, very quick one. Again, uh, yeah, it's probably like a five minute video. Um, and so yeah, I hope you guys take care and peace out everybody. See you all in the next one.